Okay, so <laughs> Professor Booker is here this morning, Design Diva, back with lots to teach. What's up, oh, lady? Yes. Oh, hello. What's the lesson today? Today is etiquette. 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 Or etiquette. Let me tell you. First of all, and that is the first thing. It is Q U E T T E. It is not quet. It's not All right, quete? it is not quete, it is not que, it's quet, it's ket. Yes, it's it ket. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, before we get into our fun lesson, and it is going to be something today because Simone is going to be our little guinea pig. Why do I um, always have to be the pig though? Well, you know, you are daily and guinea daily or too otherwise. Far. <laughs> but she can do the other thing over there. Okay, so we have lots of giveaways today. Not do only, you? what? It's like it's spring. Spring has sprung, so we have to spring into it. <laughs> it's sprung on your frock it's too. It's sprung. Very oh, colorful. Can I just tell you? Shade. Oh no yeah, bad. we are like Must colorful see, no, and such. We bring yeah, color. yeah, yeah. So anyway, so here's the situation. Not only do we give away our Penta paints this week, we are also giving away a gift certificate from Fontana, oh, really? worth a whopping five thousand dollars. You no, want it? I'm no, you don't want it. No. You're I not. Want. You want? No, you. You're not. You can't get it, and nobody else in here can't get it. Dela, you can't get it. So, five thousand dollars to the person who answers this question by text to four two one six two nine eight, and the question is name the locations. I almost said it. Name the locations and where they are in Jamaica. Pent, not Penta, Name Fontana. the locations and Name. where they are. I'm sorry. Maybe what do you say? I, I mixed up with so much. Black. Come again. Know, okay. Name, Name Fontana's locations. The Fontana's locations in Jamaica. You're welcome. All right, fine. No Thank you very much. Oh, you know no how problem. it is sometimes. It's live TV. You get yes, yourself mixed yes. up. Yes, yes. No All right. Also, First Heritage Credit Union. <coughs> right? Here we go. <coughs> They, you have to start at somewhere, right? And you pop down, pop down house, not wearing anymore. You understand what I'm saying? They are giving these loans and you have to qualify. You will qualify to get it. Just call them, get in there, get in there, get in there. They have 11 locations in Jamaica and you definitely can get a loan and you're gonna use us, Design Diva, to do it. Come. All right, are so. Are we going to dinner? We are going to dinner. We are going to dinner. No, I want you to sit here. Rules of etiquette. Quetty. Right? Yeah. Rules of etiquette are going to apply here. Okay. Um, I realize that a lot of people are going to dinner these days. Um, the ratio of man to woman is kind of off. The, you know, it's like a lot of women to men. Okay. And so a whole for washing off. Yeah, a whole okay. for washing off going on. And, you know, we're not well trained. Yeah, meaning the banana I don't man, know. hand yeah. man and okay. all of that. So here is the situation. So we have our, can everybody see the dining set, the, how it's set, how the table is set? Go on, lady. You're can you see? Up the clock. Okay, oh. we're running up the clock. Okay, here we go. If so the first thing that you have to do is take the, the, the napkin off and put it in your lap. Take the napkin off, put it in your lap. Okay? So don't All right. do this. And you don't do this and you, unless you have a lobster dinner or a seafood dinner and then you put it uh, you, and they will give you a bib. But you take the, l no. And sometimes the waiter, will, if he understands that maybe you're not really that trained, he will come like this and he will do like that and so on. Okay, so therefore you're gonna have these, you have a small fork here. You see the small fork here? This is for your salad, right? This is your entree. Because entree you're meaning the from main. the outside the in. in. If you're unsure, it's from the outside in. If it is that you you don't get that, then then the next thing is to follow somebody else who you think knows what they're doing, right? All right. This spoon here is not for what she's doing. This uh, you don't use that with a fork. This is your soup spoon. This one is your teaspoon, right? In a natural progression, you would think that the teaspoon would come here but it goes in the middle because you're going from the outside in. So usually in your courses, you're gonna get a salad, then you're gonna get your soup, and you're gonna get your appetizer. Right. So your soup is here and so on. Right. You understand what yes, I'm saying? Yes, I you're do. good posture now. You do not cough the food like oh, this. Oh, your hand cold. I know, but cold hand, warm heart. Those, some, I've seen this in a restaurant. Please don't do it. You don't cough your food. Nobody's gonna come and take it away you from you. You don't know that, you Booker. Don't, no, you so don't you know don't that. cough. You sit back. Suppose there's somebody don't touch me again. Oh, just, just come back. Suppose they sit there. Pause it. Wait. What? Pause in Dele's at the other table. She see me get served before uh -huh. her. 
She's ready, eh? She's hungry. Okay. I have to cuff my food till then she doesn't No, you don't. In. So you call the authorities, you call a waiter, and you say, waiter, this lady is about to accost me and take my food. But you do not cuff your food. Nobody is going to come and get it. Okay. You get that? Okay. Okay, fine. So the next thing is, you, this is a bread plate here. Okay, this is your, and this is your bread knife. And your bread plate is to your left. And your so bread plate is to your left. Plate. You don't take somebody's, and therefore, if you do, if you have soup, you do not use the bread and scoop it into the soup and say, you don't do that, that's not allowed. You just don't do it. You understand what I'm saying? What I'm thinking, what I'm saying is if you're gonna do fine dining, right? Then there are rules of etiquette and it has to apply unless the person that is really committing these crimes and it's not gonna be embarrassed in her. You are. This, my dear, is not a ring. It is a napkin holder. And it is not jewelry. If you, you leave it there. You understand? And that is, <laughs> and that is, if it is that you are eating and the food does not taste good, you don't spit it out, you don't spit it into a napkin or anything like that, you swallow it. Yeah, you swallow it. No. You swallow it and keep it moving. Nope. Right? Because nope. that is terrible, terrible manners. Okay? All right, so posture is important. You go from the outside in, so right? And you tea, keep it moving. Do we you, drink the tea with the finger you, cut you, off or no? If you can, if you can. Honestly, because there's a, way of do, there's a way of doing it that is natural and, and great. And so let me see, let me see. I don't okay. like this. So I think it's no, very pretentious. It's, yeah, but it's a, it's a natural way. If you're born drinking tea like this, then it, it goes out. Or if you're, if you're cold, born, you can just wrap and your you can, No, you don't do that either. No. Okay, so here we are. The, what are these? This is a red wine glass. Why it's red wine? Because red wine has to breathe and it's big, right? Then this is your champagne or you can use it as a white wine flute and this is your water goblet. You do not put red wine in a white wine glass. Infradig, don't do it. Okay. Why it, it, it gonna suffocate in this glass? This it's just not breathe. done. There's some things you don't need. A, you don't need an excuse for whatever. You just don't do it. It's okay. just not good. Okay. And you can't have a great surrounding with beautiful centerpieces and so on. And you look good. And you go to dinner. And it is all a bomb. It is just terrible. Gotcha. Okay. What are these two? Up now top? here we have <coughs> we have our dessert. Desert yes. or dessert. 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 No, dessert. the desert dessert. is the one with the sadness. No, dessert. I'm not asking you. Okay. No, you teach me etiquette. And you're going to teach, teach you. you okay, so listen, this morning I've been taught. So it is dessert. So you have your dessert spoon right Next here. Next time you come to the food, right? then you bring some food in. The bring some food in the plate? Okay, so I've been taught. Okay. Dessert. <laughs> yes. I've been brought in. <laughs> so this is our dessert. Fork, yes, right. That's for and the cake then this, and so this on. is for the cake and so on. And then you have a little bonus spoon here as well for your. Um, it ice could be for ice or? cream and things like that. So up here now would be for your dessert. Okay. So when in doubt, outside in, follow somebody else who knows what they're doing. Do not cuff your food. Uh, no, it's just. You have wrong. you seen people cuff their food? I've seen them cuff their cuff food. Their I've food seen them. Do, I'm telling you, there's a lot of stuff going on out there because I've never people seen just that. don't know. What's right? this booker? Now this can be for a treat. Say you have a cupcake oh. or you have candy or so on, then this is like a really beautiful decorative accessory that you can use, right? And th then you have your candle. Centerpieces, let's get into that. Oh, cause them even better wrap. Yeah, oh, let's get into our centerpieces here. You can do anything. Can we see this table? Oh wow, See how beautiful, beautiful it is? Right, because you can do absolutely anything as a centerpiece. Your centerpieces have to tell a story. Your centerpieces have to be, you know, just extraordinary. Mm -hmm. It does not have to be florals. It really, really doesn't. And the other right? centerpieces over and there? And then there are other centerpieces over here that you can make. All right. I the love the this. personality of a centerpiece is what is what gives it the, the bang. And we made that yesterday Can in I our studio. It? Yeah. So what it is 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 just and the thing is with artificial florals it's or so lifetime pretty. florals, you have to make sure that they look life like. It looks like, like. like spring. It looks like exactly yeah. and it looks like spring. The other thing is your containers have to be personality. So you can take anything at all and make a floral arrangement from it, right? And that is 
the way you go up, go go with it. You see this one with the hydrangeas here. We put a little birds for personality, mm -hmm. and then they just come alive. This is all artificial flowers, you know, long faux, you know, huh. and <laughs> faux, huh. and you go from there. We have a penta question this morning, yes. don't we? Yes. What is yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. It should <coughs> be on the screen somewhere. By the way, go ahead. there it is. Penta paints is known for blank and blank. Give us a hint. No, no, no. no I give no. Penta paints is known for two things. I've said it. And I can't believe you. You would even like swing the people the wrong way. That's the wrong answer. So anyway, <laughs> penta paints. Please text the answer to Shelly Ann. She's waiting. Four two one six two nine eight. There you go. Okay. And if you need to reach me, you know where I am. Yes. 12 Ocean waterfront, Boulevard waterfront. on the waterfront. It's beautiful. It's scenic. It's Very fantastic. Very nice. Thank you today for this working working visit. Yes. Um, now you know, folks, what to do and what not yeah. to do. And I shall At say... At Le York table. Mm -hmm. um, she hasn't invited me to dinner yet, but maybe one day. I don't I know. I don't cook. Okay. Well, wow. Okay. No, everybody has strengths. And you... Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much, design. I can lady. set the table. Centerpieces galore, folks. <laughs> Hope you learned a thing or ten today. That's it for Booker.